Right, and we're back guys. <clears throat> so, I've just got us back to where we were, which admittedly wasn't that far away. Uh, I got injured again a little bit due to some random enemy locations. Uh, right, let's try to take these liquors on again, shall we? <clears throat> oh no, we got spiders first, haven't we? Ah, uh, we're poisoned. Ah, fuck. And we're dead because, uh, because of course we are. Uh, okay. Fuck. Should have used the uh, bow gun to be honest. Right. <clears throat> so let's try that again. Now, because we're not actually that far away, what I might do is just let's just roll with it, shall we? Oh. And it's half past eight, man. I've got to start doing stuff soon. No. I don't want to do stuff. I want to s sit here and play this. Right, I know what we will do. <coughs> let's... Let's take... Let's drop that back. Uh, oh, God. I mean, I kind of want to take the rocket launcher with us, but it takes up so much freaking space, man. Uh, right, let's have you and, ladies and gentlemen, let's, um, yeah, let's swap that back over as well. We've got the dogs to fight, which are, like, major dick penis men, but, I mean, that's fine. Um, there are definitely some rooms as well that I've been in for a second time, and they don't have anything in, so... I'm guessing it's pointless. I, you know, I'm not a super fan of the fact that everything's so random, you know? Like, the idea that we've got to randomly, like, run around here and hope that we run into the bomb. I mean, yeah, I could probably get a walkthrough or something like that. And, um, you know, get some tips for it and that sort of shit, but... Like, you know, where's the fun in that, you know? This is going to be a dick. Wait, there's three dogs in here? What crack are you smoking? Okay, so, first time we came in here, there was two. When I came in here a minute ago, there was two. Now there's three. Bloody hell. Okay. Okay, I mean, you know, whatever, you. Right, let's grab these bolts. Yeah, we're going to grab the bolts through here as well. Um, now. Yeah, we're going to grab those bolts as well. Just because. Um, now that room through there where we find Sherry is Claire. Uh, I've been through there twice now. It's just full of zombies. There doesn't appear to be anything in there. So, uh, I mean, I don't think there's anything in there. I mean, one, this is kind of giving me, I tell you what, it's giving me the same vibe that Leech Hunter gave me. Um, the only difference with Leech Hunter is there were some pretty cool rewards for finishing that. <clears throat> um, you got to unlock unlimited ammo and stuff like that. Now, you, there are no rewards for completing this. It doesn't matter... Oh, fuck. It doesn't matter how well we do here. We don't actually get anything for doing this. Which I think's a bit arse, really. Um, I mean, apart from the fact that it is fun, and although I'm whinging and whining like a little bitch, um, it is fun. You know, I'm not going to say this isn't entertaining. <clears throat> it's Resident Evil. So by its very nature, it's fun. Oh, God. Really? Ada? Pretty sure... Oh, no. Okay, fine. Oh, shot a guy right in the buttocks. 
Okay, now it looks like as well, I thought if you were really good at this, you could bust this out in like 20, 20 minutes, uh, something like that. Apparently not. <clears throat> um, I did watch some YouTube videos where people were like doing pro runs and stuff like that, just um, to get a gauge on how long you can realistically get through this if you're fast. And it's about 40 odd minutes. Um, so, it, yeah, it's not a quick mode. I really hate liquors. I hate liquors. Liquors can suck my ass. Oh, I hate the bowgun. I hate the bowgun as well. Can I say that now? Ugh. I was actually really enjoying the bowgun against zombies. Against liquors, though, yeah. it. Mm. Wait, there was three guys here when we played this last time. There was three liquors in here, and that's why we died. Now there's only two. <clears throat> Small mercies, I guess. Well, there's nothing here. Uh, I guess nothing here. Past the point of right. Okay, so this is just like another way that we could have potentially gone. So this was pointless. Um, I did find a, a little list of all the areas where the bomb could spawn, and it's. There's, there's, there's a, a long list of rooms where the bomb could spawn. I think it's like eight or nine different locations. <sighs> Which, yeah. Yeah. So, essentially, even if you have a list of where, uh, of all the rooms, I mean, you've still got to go through the whole game anyway, so. It doesn't help you much, Chief. It does not help you much. Let's just say that. I think even as a kid, this is a mode that I wouldn't have really played that much, even when I had loads of time. Because even as a wee lad, even as a young Sega fan, um, I don't think I would have had the patience for it. I should uh, get wound up really quick, though. I mean, I still have that, like, little bit of temper that um, I get when I get frustrated with video games. I still get a little bit ragey, but nothing like I used to be. Oh, I used to see red. I used to get really angry. I used to have to turn the game off and go for a walk or something. Uh, oof. Yeah, these days I just get pissed off and <laughs> just like start getting angry at the game. Like, game, how dare you make me look stupid? How dare you waste my time? When in actual uh, fact, it's you know not the it's not the game's fault. I'm shit. That's that's what I gotta keep telling myself. It's not the game's fault that you're ru Ooh, rubbish. Fuck this. Let me guess, there's more than one. Uh, yeah, there's more than one. That's quite handy. Why would there only be one? <sighs> okay. Yeah, let's just uh, write that up. Actually, we could potentially go back up there and take those guys out I guess. Is there anything in here though? I mean there's bolts which is good. There's no like ammo or any of that good stuff. There's more bolts. Okay. So we've got Marvin's room. We yeah we could take out those Mr. X's up there. We certainly do have the ammo. That's not even um, thinking about the overwhelming firepower that we have. Let's have a look outside. The overwhelming firepower that we have outside. Let's go get a herb before we do anything else because we're not stupid. 
Now, what is possibly going to be in here? If it's zombies, we're okay. Yeah, we're okay. There we go. Share the wealth. Right, let's go grab us up a herb. E uh, no, a good one, please. Thank you. Right, that'll do. Might as well clear this room out. Nope, nothing behind us. Is there anything in the drawer? I guess not. Okay, cool. Right, let's go outside and have a look. Let's go see if there's anything wandering around. Yeah, there's a lot of information coming out now with Ubisoft as well, saying that uh, female characters, female lead characters, do not sell uh, video games. Um, oh, the door. Oh, okay, we can't go outside. Uh, yeah, so nobody wants to play games with female lead characters. Um, excuse me? Are you sure about that? Uh, I think you're wrong. <laughs> um, oh, what can I hear? Oh, God, that's what I can hear. Oh, shot him out of the sky. Oh, God. Kicked him in the knickers. Yeah, uh, personally, I think video games with female characters in are fine. You know, I do remember a time in gaming where ooh, there was this whole video game, uh, female lead characters don't sell. And that was quite an interesting time in gaming as well because we had stuff like Remember Me, uh, I think, what was the other game? Mirror's Edge, which I actually quite liked but a lot of people didn't. Mirror's Edge 2, which again fell kind of short, but then I never played that one. Um, what these publishers didn't realise was at the time, a lot of these games that had female lead characters in were rubbish or subpar. It's not that you're playing a female character. It's the fact that the game you're playing is not good. You know, look at Tomb Raider. Look at, um, oh god, I'm trying to talk and think. You know, this is a topic that I actually need to get into on a, on, a, on a proper video, which I may do actually, yes. Right. Okay, yeah, I like that. I like this. That, that's a topic that I thought was just so retarded. Oh, Ivies. Oh god, Ivies. Okay. Oh boy. Right, let's go around here. Let's see if we can kill these items. Is it dead? Yeah, one down. That's one. Don't know if we're actually hitting that one. Yeah, we are. We're locked on. Yeah, it's dead. It's dead. We gone. We gone. Okay, I'm not seeing a bomb. Now, this is one of the rooms that can contain... Ah, look at that. You whip my buttocks. There is a bomb. So, we have two bombs. We have two bombs. Okay. So that's not bad. So two down. Two down, two to go. Oh. Yeah, we can handle the zombies. You know, let's just use this because there's loads of ammo for this. Yeah, well, I mean, I say there's loads of ammo for this. I wouldn't say there's loads of ammo for this. Um, wait a minute. I mean, there isn't loads of ammo in this room. I mean, there is loads of ammo for this. We have too many bolts, you know. They're coming out of our ass. We're literally leaving them sprinkled behind us as we walk around. They're falling out of our pocket. We have so many. Now... I don't know if we have to have all these bombs in our inventory. I have no idea. 
zombies. Definitely, oh, definitely was expecting something else in here. Not even a liquor. I was thinking maybe there would be some ivies or something. But hey, I guess not. Still haven't got my Dreamcast modded either. Uh, I really want to get on that. Uh, I'm feeling fairly fortunate that I have one that works, considering I've seen a lot of these cropping up on the market sites at the moment not working. Worryingly as well, it's a lot of people that are taking them out of um, storage and trying them and they don't work anymore. So I'm hoping the fact that mine's still getting used and there's still power going through the power supply and stuff like that, the capacitors are getting charged and whatnot, maybe that's keeping it alive. I don't know. I don't know if capacitors die after a while. I know they discharge over time. Um, Alright, we've been all... Ooh. Uh, there is still... Somewhere through here that we haven't been. Yes. Okay. Let's go have a look up here. Uh, I guess we can go all the way to the uh, back exit or the back entrance of the police precinct. That can make sense. See, the thing is, like, I'm thinking in my head, I actually really would like to try the harder difficulties, but <laughs> I know I'm just going to get really pissed off. That's the trouble. Oh, yeah, that's right. The ivies. That's fine. Yeah. What ivy was it? Right. Just a garden variety ivy. Uh, let's eat that. Alright, that's fine. Do you have anything? You don't have any bullets? No. There's definitely going to be another one around here. Oh, God. Yeah, that's fine. I'd rather you punch me in the face than spit your poisonous acid on me. So, you know, there's that, I guess. Right, cool. Nope, we're clear. Ah, oh, we can still go all the way out here and all the way to the back. Apparently there's sometimes a bomb in the star's office. Oh, we got zombies out here. Huh. Cool. Now, if you're thinking that there's some kind of uh, final boss or something at the end, uh, as far as I'm aware, and I haven't really read up like any spoilers or anything like that. I'm trying to keep myself spoiler-free on this mode. Um, as far as I'm aware, there isn't. Why do I get the feeling Mr. X is going to be out here? No birds. Ooh. We can handle a few birds. Ada, come on. Yes. Yes. Fuck you, birds. All right. Okay, I can still hear them. Now, is there going to be a bomb through here? I have no idea. And can we actually go through? Oh, it's a save room. I mean, I know it's a save room, but... Okay. Red herbs. Uh, a red herb. Two red herbs. Is it worth it? I mean, maybe. I guess. I suppose we can take them because we're going to go through um, a save room anyway. Now, can we go back through this room? We can. We can! Right, well, I wasn't expecting that. Okay. That's quite cool. 
Come on, you bastards. Lead fucking treats for all of you. Here's your Scooby snacks. And I'm right here. Nice and hot. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. So, do we have anything in here then? No. Again, another kind of like pointless room, I guess. Hmm. Well, at least we've got a look of this at this place, I suppose. I mean, we've pacified the area. With Ada, we don't really need these bloody virus bombs, do we? Because she's doing a good job of blowing everything to pieces. Oh, I really am running out of time. <laughs> oh, no. No. I've been recording this for like hours now. I've had a few breaks because I've had stuff to do, but uh, I really did think this was going to be a quick, um, a quick ride through. It's getting tense though. It really is. And we haven't had as many. Yeah, there's nothing down there. We haven't had as many Mr. X's yet as I would have thought. I was kind of expecting them to there to be more of them. I'm guessing that's where the harder difficulties uh, come into play. You know. The ivies are now gone from in here, which is good. I can't believe this dude doesn't have anything. That's a bit strange. Um, right. So, uh, yeah, so this area is basically cleared out. So we've only got two areas left, really. Uh, let's go back through here. We'll get a top up on ammo, I guess. I kind of want to grab the rocket launcher, but we haven't needed it. So what's the point? And should I put down another safety save? Uh, I kind of think maybe. You fool. Fool of a duck. Uh, let's put that bomb back. Again, I don't know if we need all these in our inventory at the same time. I don't know. I'm sure we're going to find out together. Uh, I was going to say we we'll grab some more ammo, but uh, I don't know if we need to, to be honest. There's definitely more than enough ammo to go through all of this. Like, there's no worries there. Let's put down another safety save. I mean, I kind of feel like a little schoolgirl putting all these safety saves down. But at the same time, I mean, this is the first time I've ever gone through this mode. Uh, I have done the previous two stages a lot. But I haven't done this stage before. I, I, you know, I, I've got to this stage and I've constantly got killed and as I said I did have a really good run earlier uh, and we had a power cut which was great oh no no it wasn't great it was really annoying yep Mr. X should we take him out let's see how many bullets it takes to take him out just because we can um, Ada, move. Just because we can. Okay, let's switch up to something with a bit of bite to it, shall we? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, it's not going down too well, is it? Right, empty. Okay, he's. N I don't think he's actually that much stronger than normal. Stronger, yes, but he's not that much stronger. Yeah. Okay. Mr. X. You're a bit of a pussy, mate. 
Hmm, maybe the bow gun's a little bit... I don't know. You know, I don't know how I feel about the bow gun. Uh, it, mm. Now, let's go to the library. Let's go for some good reading. Let's put some damn ammo in our weapons as well. No enemies here. Ooh. How strange is that? What is that? Oh. Like 2,000 packets of handgun bullets. Yes, please. It's so cool seeing these uh, ammo packs, like, placed in different areas. Uh, something about it pleases me. Russell's me jimmies. In a good way. Uh, and it's so cool, like, seeing stuff like this, like, completely empty. Ah, it's just weird, man. Again, it's weird in a good way. Uh, well, I mean, we could go down there, but there's no point. Right, what's through here? Probably bad mix. I was going to take a swig of my drink then, and I was like, well, that would have been... Pit. Oh, and we're poisoned. We're poisoned. Badly poisoned. Good thing we took that. Right, and we've got IVs all the way, another IV all the way down there. It's dead. Die, motherfucker, die. Die, motherfucker, die. I think we've been going for like two hours now on this. Right, do we have any big bad booms in here? I'm hoping so. Yes. Yes. Okay. Nice. Very nice. Alright, right. One left to find. One left to find. Hmm. Those um poison ivies are something a little bit serious, aren't they? Why is the music Changed. The music's changed. Oh, I don't like that. That's freaking me out. Why is the music changed? Why is the music changed? Game. Have you, like, spawned some big, horrible ugly bastards now. Oof. Oh, you know, like those things. Oh, and we've got no bloody health. <sighs> okay. You're dead. How many? What's the damage? How many? Ah, oh, no. Ah, oh, come on. Come on. Oh, no, we're empty, we're empty, we're empty. Fuck you. Oh. If they did eat me, I would hope I gave them the shits. Uh, if anyone knows where that quote's from, I'll be impressed. I hope I give you the shits. <sighs> okay. Really, game? Did you have to spawn those things? Was it necessary? Dogs. Alright. 
don't mind dogs. Do we mind dogs? We might mind dogs. Oh, this is... Oh, the bowgun. You know, the bowgun, it ain't bad against dogs. Right, stars room. Stars. What have we got? What have we got? What have we got? What have we got? Hmm. Ah, sweet FA here. I haven't heard this music track before. I like it. Nothing. Oh no. Oh, where could it be? Have we possibly missed it somewhere? <sighs> where could it be? Where haven't we been? There's a few rooms left. Literally a few. Um... Maybe... Okay. Yeah, get out of here, pal. Ah. Come on. <laughs> One of those actually hit. I think that's the longest range zombie takedown I've ever had in this game. Groovy. Come on, Ada. I know it's been a long couple of hours together, but uh, I think maybe, just maybe. Oh, what else would it have been? What else would it have been? You think Uncle fucking Fester's down here? I think not. Oh, no. Oh, he's dead. I like it when they die. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay. It does sound like there's at least one more outside. I'm going to put down my final safety save. Oh, herbs. Sweet herbage. Come to mummy. I was going to say daddy then, but I think Ada's female. Difficult to tell, I know. Uh, I don't think he's ever... Well, no, 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 she does reference herself as a woman. I'm just a woman that fell in love. Oh, God. Right, do we want to put down a safety save? Or do we want to risk getting murdered? Oh, that would be tragic at this point. You know, there's more than enough health. I give them that. that you, you know, if you die, it really is your own issue. Um, and I, I still don't know if we have to have all these bombs on us at once. I don't know. Let's put this back. And let's put this back. And let's put this back. And... Let's get that... And Ada's kind of getting to the point now where she's had enough. She's getting fed up. So she's going to reach into here and she's going to get out the big gun. There we go. She's armed to the teeth and dressed to kill. Now we might not need it. You know. We might not need it. But if we do... Fuck you. Bitch. Die like the bitch you are. Okay, let's go through this corridor first. And then we're going to the Marvin Brannan room. Ooh! Wow, they are tough, man. They really are. Ivy's okay, I mean... Yeah, 
depending on how bullshit their placement is. I think too bad. Oh god, hang on. Yeah, it's not too bad, I suppose. We can handle it. He doesn't seem that bothered, to be honest. Nope, he's dead. Right, let's have a little look in here. Maybe it's in here, possibly. There's nothing else in here. Apparently. Ooh, there it is. Right, we've got all four. I guess we need to have them all at the same time. Question Oh no, no we don't. Okay. Now we're probably gonna get the worst rank in the world. Ada knows what to do. She knows where to put these bad boys. Ada's no fool. It feels right playing this as Ada as well, you know? She's got a long run ahead of her. Oh man. Whoa, that like goes on for miles. Mission complete. Oh god, how long. Thanks to your efforts, the hazardous virus has been eradicated from our world. <laughs> All of humanity has been saved from the terror of this biohazard. Yeah, for now. Stories will be told for generations to come about your great achievement. Nobody knows of single-handedly overcoming all adversity. Congratulations. Thank you. Yay, I'm a hero. <laughs> wow. We did it, guys, I think. Result. Oh. Okay, we won't actually do that for quite as, for quite as long as I, as I thought. Okay. Wait. So we don't even get ranked. We don't get nothing. You get nothing for doing that whatsoever. Oh, really? Get nothing for doing that. Um, well, okay. I mean, so there's nothing to unlock. There's nothing to see. Uh, hmm. So if we go to like special gas, so there's no point really in like rough sketch. I mean, we can look at these, these are cool. So there's literally no point. Oh, I like that. He's wearing like PlayStation 5 armor. No, Leon, no, no. <laughs> oh man, can you imagine if Leon had like a K9? <laughs> that would be pretty rad. Uh, she's got like armored boots. I don't mind that. Very strange outfit she's wearing there. I, you know, I remember thinking that looks so cool when I was a kid. But then, you know, then you start thinking a little bit more logically as an old man and you're like, 
thinking to herself, she's actually openly walking around the city with like a huge knife strapped to her chest. Yeah, pretty sure that wouldn't fly. I like that's cool as well. I do like that outfit. And that, of course, is Lisa Walker, I believe. Alyssa, I can't think of her name now. Who we was meant to get instead of Claire, which of course we didn't. God knows what that is. That yeah, not bad. <laughs> Lumberjack Joe. I Lumberjack Joe. Lumberjack Claire. I don't mind that. Uh, that is a very Rebecca Chambers pose. I like the shorts. Oh, that's quite a cool picture. Ducati. Mm. Placement there. Ada looking badass as always. Ooh. <laughs> nah. Eh. Oh dear. She has this very. She looks very mournful, doesn't she? Uh, she's got a bit of attitude there. Okay. Whoa. Annette. And there's our there's our boy. Marvin Brannan. It's so cool in the remake to see a lot more of him. Um, you know, they could do like a... They could do a really cool kind of like horde mode bonus game. Whereas you play as the police. Uh, and you have to survive uh, nights at the, at the police station with increasing waves of enemies. And you've got to like after each attack you've got to see who you've got left alive and manage equipment scavenge equipment rebuild barricades that could be fun now you unlock these the more you actually play the game and the more uh like modes and shit you complete i think oh dude that's savage We've unlocked quite a few of them now. Oof. Whoa. And spiders were eerily absent as well from the remakes. Why? Ooh, that looks cool. Oof. Is that... Nah, that's, that's not Claire. Ooh. We didn't see what... We never saw that, did we? There's the drop pods. Oh, look at that. Fucking love to be able to draw like this. And that's it. Wait, have I got them all? I have. I've unlocked all of them. I've never unlocked them all before. I don't even know how I did that. Usually it just skips like 10 and then goes from like 47 to 50 or like you'll, you'll be on, I don't know, 52 and it'll jump to 58 because you're missing loads. That's interesting. So that's the gallery anyway. So, I mean, there we go, guys. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to leave it there. I Maybe we'll go through EX Battle again. Maybe we shall try the harder difficulties. I don't know. I, I, it's probably going to have to be a time when I'm on holiday. Because it's going to have to be um, when I've got time to actually like sit down and practice it and shit like that. Which I don't have uh, when I'm not. Um... When I'm not on holiday, I just don't have that much time, which is a shame because I'd actually like to give them a go. I'm not going to promise that I'm ever going to complete them, especially the hardest one. But I had fun. I enjoyed that. Um, now, we are going to do a ranged mode at some point, but I think for now we're going to put Resident Evil 2 down. And we're going to move on to something else. But of course, we will come to, back to Resident Evil 2 in time because come on. Now, are we going to do Resident Evil 2 Arrange Mode on the Dreamcast? Or are we going to do the GameCube version? Hmm. I don't know. Anyway, guys, I'm going to have to say thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.